We also love to be loved. We also can have families. We also can have children. Can the society understand all this? Has the God been very biased? Or is our creation has any special purpose? These are the questions which I am still trying to find answers. Those fully endowed physically seldom display the willingness or ability to look beyond themselves and reach out to others who need help. But Padma Shri S. Ramakrishnan, a bright engineer who turned quadriplegic at the age of 21 through a quirk stroke of destiny, was determined to be different from such ordinary mortals. Normally, this kind of accident would have completely demoralized the individual and made him or her useless for the rest of life, all the time thinking about what the problem was. Ramakrishnan converted them into an opportunity for training large number of people uh, in terms of new skills, new scope, how to overcome their deficiency. Battling against the impossible, he founded Amar Seva Sangam in the year 1981 at his native village Aikuri in the then Tirunelveli district of Tamil Nadu. Heading from his wheelchair, he built an inclusive school, a rehabilitation centre for polio-affected children, creating awareness for the differently abled and took various other initiatives to bring light and hope into the lives of thousands of forgotten humans. By God's grace and with the full support of our malicious donors, our trainers and our service users, Sangam has been growing steadily. During this time, he met Mr. S. Shankara Raman in 1991, a prolific chartered accountant with gold medal and a wheelchair person diagnosed with muscular dystrophy. His decision to join Amar Seva Sangam the following year was a major turning point for Mr. Ramakrishnan. Since then, fighting all odds and with systematic approach, meticulous planning and support from various partners from India and around the world, Mr. Ramakrishnan and Mr. Raman created a valley for the disabled. When I visited Amar Seva Sangam, I was awestruck by the natural beauty of the simple village nestled in the foothills of the mountain range in such beautiful natural surroundings. I was equally captivated by Mr. Ramakrishna, who had a vision to improve the lives of children who are from very poor families and suffering from various disabling conditions. I instantly decided that I would do what I could to help and contribute to his vision. We initiated several major projects at Amaseva Sangam, such as the Sangam School, the school expansion, the Life Care Centre and the current Early Intervention Project, which is a major ongoing endeavour. Uh, we deliver physiotherapy, occupational therapy, speech therapy, special education uh, to all the service users. Uh, whoever comes to Amar Seva Sangam for their rehabilitation, so they are initially assessed by our rehab professional, then they are directed into the particular department like Sangam Special School, Special Training Center, Physiotherapy Center, Scalibur Unit. We are also following a lot of international standards, scales and assessment. Amar Sangam will continue to focus on more and more rehabilitation through technology-based initiatives. It will also implement smart classes for the, all these school uh, in the campus. Besides making the campus a smart campus within the uh, next few years. A vision they had been nurturing, which is a barrier-free environment with all facilities under one roof. Over the years, the campus expanded into a multifaceted rehabilitation hub, providing quality treatment, 
therapies and other initiatives. I was able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get a lot of people who were able to get இப்போ இப்போ பரவாயில்ல நல்லா இருக்கேன்னா இதே மாதிரி சங்கத்தில் நிறையா பேர் வந்து பயனடைஞ்சிட்டு இருக்காங்க நம்மளை மாதிரி பிள்ளைங்களும் இதை மாதிரி விளையாடுவாங்களா அது அங்கே போய் தான் நான் தெரிஞ்சுக்கிட்டேன் ஸ்டேட் லெவல் நேஷ்னல் லெவல் இதுவரை சிக்ஸ் நேஷ்னல் விளாண்டுருக்கேன் இல்லை ஃபஸ்ட்டு ஃபோர் நேஷ்னல் வந்து கோல்டு மெடல் ரெண்டு சில்வர் மெடல் அது மட்டும் இல்லாமல் இப்போ வீல் சேர் ரேஸ்லேயும் இருக்கிறேன் ஒன்று கோல்டு மெடல் சில்வர் மெடல் ரெண்டுமே வாங்கிட்டு இருக்கிறேன் அமர்சிவாங்கிட்டேன் which is not limited to only campus based activities but lined up with extraordinary initiatives beyond the campus the amar seva sangam team conceived unique community rehabilitation model involving differently abled persons from the communities itself and created self help groups with a network of their trained community rehabilitation workers and involving these self help group members the team successfully implemented several innovative initiatives which created significant impact transforming the lives of the differently abled people we started moving with the uh, public we started going to the villages the necessities are more and uh, uh we started planning according to the needs of the uh, charity persons in the villages enak rendu kondal maatra thanali da periya ponna amur seva sangathu kondu pone avalukku therapy romba thevai nu sonnanga therapy koduthukittirundha adukadathu or paiyan veranda avenu apdi irukka adanal enak rendu pulaiye kondu vittu poga mudiyala veetla vayasaali irukanga husband veliyukku irukanga எனக்கு போக முடியல அமர் சேவா சங்கத்திலேருந்து வந்து ஒரு டீம் வந்து இப்போ வீட்டில் வந்து தெரப்பி கொடுக்காங்க அது ரொம்ப உதவியாக இருக்குது பிள்ளைகளுக்கும் நல்ல இம்ப்ரூவ்மெண்ட்டும் இருக்குது என் பொண்ணு முயற்சி பண்ணி முடியாதுன்னு சொன்ன இடத்துல இன்றைக்கி என் பொண்ணு நல்ல முறையில் வளர்ந்து ஆளாகி நல்லா படிக்கிறா ஸ்கூல் போகிறா நல்லா நடக்கிறா எந்த எல்லாமே பண்ணி அவளாக செய செயல்படுத்திக்கிடுதா இந்த இவ்வளவுக்கு இவ்வளோ கொண்டு வந்ததுக்கு அமர் சேவா சங்கத்துக்கும் நன்றி Abu Bakar uh, identification was uh, done he when he was a uh, first year of age with the cerebral palsy since then we are giving a regular uh, physiotherapy treatment special education and uh, speech training for him from that uh, he are gaining uh, some improvement Abu Bakar initially was a uh, bedridden after getting the physiotherapy treatment properly he can able to walk with support or other uh, supporting device எனக்கு வந்து வலது காலம் வலதுலையும் செயல்படாது அதனால் பாதிக்கப்பட்டது சரி ஏதாவது ஒரு தொழில் கற்றுக்கிடணும் நம்ம சும்மா இருந்த எனக்கு ஒரு மாதிரி இருந்தது அதுக்கு பிறகு நான் தொழில் கற்றுக்கிட்டேன் மண்பானது எங்கள் அண்ணன் செஞ்சுக்கிட்டு எங்கள் வீட்டில் செஞ்சுக்கிட்டு இருந்தாங்க அதை பார்த்து நான் செஞ்சேன் அந்த வெற்றிக்கடன் குழுவில் சேர்ந்து ஒரு லோன் கணக்கு எடுத்து கடை வச்சுருக்கேன் கடை என் வருமானம் எனக்கு வருமானம் உயர்ந்திருக்கனால அமர் சேவ் சங்கத்துக்கு நன்றி கைண்ட் ஆஃப் ஒப்பீனியன் ஆர் a uh, perception that disability is something different cannot be seen with our people or cannot be seen in our area they are all totally accepted this is what we want to show to the world in india an estimated 7.8 million children are affected by different kind of disabilities and it is proven that kids born with delayed development if provided timely intervention can show a significant improvement and can lead a well adjusted life in the community The concept of early intervention is still constrained to the idea of only clinical intervention largely more so in the rural areas. 
Early intervention is the family-centered therapeutic services for children who are having developmental delay. But these kind of specialist services are not available in the rural area due to many reasons. In order to change this perception and providing these children with advanced rehabilitation treatments, Amar Seva Sangam has been working actively in the field of early intervention since 2012 in collaboration with Handicare International Canada and several universities and experts from all over the world. Going beyond their campus-based centre, the team devised doorstep rehabilitation to ease out the challenges faced by parents and kids in the communities. And during this time, Mr. S. Shankara Raman of Sangam and Dr. Dinesh Krishna of Handicare International conceived an innovative digital solution to provide remote rehabilitation services to children with disabilities in their own homes, schools and local centres supported by specialists and community rehabilitation workers. A first-of-its-kind initiative in India, Amar Seva Sangam's Enabling Inclusion Model Powered by Enabling Inclusion app is a real-time mobile technology platform which has proved to be an end-to-end -end case management and rehabilitation solution ensuring 75% cost reduction, up to 87% school enrollments for children with disability, increased parent empowerment and reducing their strain and improved parent-child interaction up to 95%. With four decades of expertise and research, today Amar Seva Sangam established a center of excellence. Our center of excellence's approach is to provide and support child development and rehab solutions to organizations, service providers, parents, and communities to benefit millions of children with disabilities and their families globally. We have gained a lot of knowledge and our learnings are there to be shared. For this purpose, we want to institutionalize our knowledge assets and uh, make it available to the society for the benefit to our country and also to millions of persons with disabilities all over the world. The Immersiva Center of Excellence will soon be launching a portal for the Enable Inclusion Learning Platform. This will include courses, webinars, PowerPoints, discussion groups, and various topics of interest for the public to access. We look forward to engaging everyone interested in early intervention and child development. This is one of our dream project to enable others, uh, other NGOs or other organizations to provide rehabilitation solutions in the field. Thus far, Sangam has partnered with several NGOs and government departments across the country by way of licensing, knowledge partnership and public-private initiatives, brought in a transformatory policy in Tamil Nadu state to facilitate the launch of a rights project with the World Bank and will soon be onboarding World Vision in Ethiopia. We have partnership as a knowledge partner with our Tamil Nadu government. I intend to, in my official capacity, take these engagements and interventions to the next level and so that the efforts and expertise of Amar Seva Sangam can be utilized for the welfare of the people. I should state that nothing has inspired me more in the recent years than to meet with these great men and to learn about their services and efforts. And also we are supporting District Early Intervention Centers. District Early Intervention Center is a central government program located in every district at the district headquarters hospital. This is a specialist services for children below 18 years to identify defects, delay, disabilities and deficiencies to give the medical care. Amar Seva Sangam working with the Tenkasi District Early Intervention Program. After the medical care, we give the therapeutic services at the District Early Intervention Center itself. The children who cannot come to the district hospitals, we have also registered them into the home-based uh, services in the children's home. Amar Seva Sangam's enabling inclusion model has the flexibility to fit into other organizations' process flow and has already bagged several Indian and global recognitions. Whenever I think about uh, Amar Seva Sangam, I feel it is serving the God. With changing digital technology, barriers of funding and overcoming various other challenges, Amar Seva Sangam is committed to continue to their path of transformation 
with exciting plans to scale the whole country so that no child with disabilities is denied of schooling experience, the right to rehabilitation and reach their full potential. To orang yang ini kalbi ini alit, nama de samudaya itu, awal kali ini wonder naik ke puri apa kehilaya, hat chal mungkin sayur beri ni berada di mekum parak tu kuriya de, drama orang kali ini balas cik orang baru orang kurang ni kali kan dah rindu, awal kali ini ilham teri sendre, anda kurang ni kali kan ana awam bagal pecium, petualang kan ana beri hati dalam ilham, amar serva sengga beri ni berada di rindu, nama parak tu keren. Anda bagi keluar. Mua air itu kerja merpati terperkai. Ia pergi petrol air ini dengan mudik ceri keren. Mula zon tu mail mail on thora ratum ini dalam barat keren. Hamar serva sengat ini tu aku uru mana panik keluar ke. Nama darah se. Kebayaan aku terbikin ini cium aku uru dia siyum ini dalam uru dia antar ratum. Anal abargal iru varum. Indah ki mantra teran pada itu berlalu virindalum kuda. Mantra teran aligal kana ora amai pay tengasi ilnubi. Narpa da anda galaga nadete kundur pajam bazar magatana sevei unmei le ibargal. Iru varum mani dargal ilu puni dargal. For me, coming to Amar Seva Sangam is like like a pilgrimage. It's like visiting a temple. In our Sanatan Sanskriti and Adhyatma, Mano Seva is Param Dharma. It is the supreme Dharma to serve the humanity. This institution is doing great work. He will continue doing it. We are all very happy about it. And we all commit ourselves to do whatever we can in our own ways, big or small to assist this institution. The enormous and remarkable work of Amar Seva Sangam has not gone unnoticed. Sangam has been honored with numerous and countless appreciations worldwide. Also, in January 2020, Mr. S. Ramakrishnan was conferred with the Padma Shri, the fourth highest civilian award in the Republic of India for his and Sangam's contribution towards the society. Amar Seva Sangam has done a very wonderful service to the disabled children. I would appeal to all to help this organization as much as possible because it is service that will lead the poor and the disabled. It is a legacy that Amar Seva Sangam has created within these four decades which has started a disability movement across the nation, embracing scores of challenges and accomplishments, creating revolutionary impact in countless lives. I would like to see myself in that kind of an India, where everything is equal and there is no disadvantage for disabled people. We hope in another 20 years, People disabled the community will have all facilities throughout the nation. Let us hope for the best. And the untiring journey continues. The sun has come out. This is the day. Darkest of clouds won't stand in your way. Stronger.